So we've talked about uh, water infrastructure and maintenance. We've talked about where our water comes from. Now it's time to talk about water quality. So I'm in the water quality lab. I'm here with the water quality lab administrator, Jim Williams. Jim, tell us how we can be sure that our water supply is safe. Well, our laboratory, we monitor uh, our drinking water um, throughout our distribution system and at our water treatment plants. Uh, we monitor it several times a day for various constituents to make sure that we meet or are better than the federal and state drinking water requirements. We perform many of the tests in-house. 95% of the tests that we do are, are done in-house in the laboratory. Uh, we perform over 25,000 tests per year in here. We also test the water at our water reclamation facilities to make sure it meets the federal and state EPA requirements. We also participate in many studies, many federally mandated studies, such as the unregulated contaminant monitoring rule, the uh, long-term enhanced surface water treatment rule, the lead and copper rule, and our stage two disinfection byproduct rule. We also help our uh, distribution folks by testing and making sure that any new pipelines are adequately disinfected uh, before those lines are put into service. Okay, Jim, so where can residents go to find out more about the quality of their drinking water? Well, each year uh, we, we post a consumer confidence report, and that consumer confidence report provides information about the water quality for that previous year. And that is posted on the City of Glendale Water Services Department webpage. Uh, this year, our consumers can expect to see that report uh, posted on the webpage in May. And uh, that report will include uh, the information, it includes a table that tells uh, anything that we've detected in uh, our drinking water. It also includes tips to the consumer uh, about the drinking water and other tips. And it includes uh, frequently asked questions. And uh, that re report again will be available on the city webpage in May. All right, well, thank you so much for your time and thank you for joining us today, Jim. Well, thank you.